Nearly nine months of gruelling urban warfare has left Mosul in ruins. The Iraqi army has almost entirely driven out the self-styled Islamic State group, which had occupied the city for three years. But the Mosul they've taken back is unrecognizable. The old town is nothing but rubble, with much of the city flattened by airstrikes and explosions during the long battle. The airport, railway station and university were all destroyed. Thousands of civilians were killed and injured in the campaign, and dead bodies still lie on the streets. It was once home to 1.5 million people, but now almost two-thirds have fled, many of them still displaced. The reconstruction of the city will be no small task. Iraqi officials say Mosul's wrecked roads, bridges and broader economy will take at least five years to repair. The UN predicts it will cost at least $1 billion just to restore basic services, something the Iraqi government will struggle to afford.